DACA seems on the verge of success in capturing Batman, but Batman continues to carry the fight to the enemy. He's out, all right. Yeah, we'll put him in the box. You wait here. I'll take the girl back and send a couple of truckmen over for the box. Well, make it snappy. Kick your brains out. That's strong enough to hold you. Yes, Bruce? Encode. A-M-L-O-C-K-E-D. Inbox. How does the rest of the message read? Am locked in box in upstairs room. Bay window. Be careful. Someone here. Come on. We've got to hurry and help the master. No, I'll go alone. Better wait here. Call the police if I'm not back in five minutes. Uh, wait a minute, Mr. Wait. This may come in a bit handy. <laughs> All right. Hold him. We'll let him take my place, and when they come back to the box, we'll follow him. I'll wait one more minute. Unload the new exhibit and put it up on that car. Alfred, I'm going to give you another chance to help us. Splendid, sir. May I say that now you're cooking with gas? Now listen carefully. Rob and I have to get into that place without being seen. Now what I want you to do is to go down here ahead of us and get that attendant out of the way. Thanks, boys. Close up, Joe. Come on, boys, give me a hand with that box. No, let the zombies do it. Juan Brown, bring that box from the cave.
Это боева. One brown, throw that box into the pit. It's not the Batman. It's Wallace. We gotta get him out of there. Too late. I, I can't understand it. I helped put the Batman in the crate myself. Wallace must have let him get out. That's the price he pays for his carelessness. Well, look, old boy. I want to see your blooming old cave, and I'm going in even if I have to bash you in the face. Yeah, that, well, that's a great idea, son, but I've got another idea. Sorry to do this. Just got to be done. destroyed, I must accomplish it myself. I must devise an infallible means for the extermination of him. sent this business for profit, I would say this is a very bad day. <laughs> to Captain Arnold. But first, I'm going to find out what's on the other side of that door. useless for you to struggle. My zombies are too strong, even for a superior person like yourself to cope with. Pat and Jones, bring him to my electronic laboratory. Call up these rabbits, you Jap murderer! If you value your life, you better address me as Dr. Dacca. I know who you are. We've been searching for you ever since you killed those two agents assigned to your deportation. What a pity you will never be able to report that you found me. Stun him! Follow me. Ask 
fasten him in the zombie chair. <laughs> that will do you no good to struggle. Besides, very soon you will obey my every command. Pat and George, return to your station. Perhaps while you still have your senses, you would be interested to know how I create my slaves. I have another little surprise for you before I change you into a zombie. Martin Warren, Linda Page, come into the laboratory. Step up to him. Slap his face. <laughs> Step back. Are you Jap devil? Now I'm going to satisfy a curiosity I've had for a long time. I'm going to find out who the Batman really is. What are you ah. up to, buddy? Oh, uh, nothing really, old chap. I uh, just trying to get in to see a friend. Well, isn't that interesting? I'm sure the captain would like to hear all about it. Oh, but really, I'm not a footpad, you know. No, but he'd like to hear all about that, too. Come along. Oh. Robin, get that chair. Is it possible to restore Miss Page to her normal condition? It is, by me. All right, Doctor. Take your choice. Either bring her back to her senses or become a zombie yourself. My choice is obvious. Linda Page, sit in that chair. All right, I'm ready to start. Before I can do any of the operations, it will be necessary to untie me. And give you a chance to smash this equipment? Oh, no, I'll operate it. You just tell me what to do. First, remove the zombie headpiece. Next, the bell over the head must be lowered. Robin. That's good. Man switch. I see these must be here for a reason. Yes, they saved your life. seem fully conscious yet. The pressure has been relieved from her brain. She'll be all right a little while. She better be. What about her Uncle Martin? We'll take care of him next. And then all the others. If you 
brought me out on a wild goose chase this time of night, I'll have you sent up for five years. I assure you, sir, that that man is in dire need of your assistance. Look at this. A record of everyone who works for this Axis stooge. Good work. Ah, listen to this entry. July 17th. Sam Fletcher's false testimony sent Martin Warren to prison. Congratulations, Mr. Warren. I believe this book not only exonerates you, but will enable the government to round up a lot of traitors. Oh, I didn't need any proof. I knew he was innocent all the time. <laughs> ah! Stay where you are. Come with me, Miss Page. Robin, push the button that closes that door. Robin, find the button that closes this. Well, I wonder who they are. There's a door here. Huh? Well, they'll keep. They're pretty well tied up. Come on. Stay where you are, Batman. Well, I finally caught up with you, huh? It's indeed a pleasure to meet you, Captain Arnold. The most famous police officer in America. Yeah? How do you figure that? Because tomorrow the newspapers will headline your discovery of a Jap spy ring. Spy ring? In here? Yes. Where do those doors lead to? To a very interesting laboratory. Search it, boys. You will also get credit for capturing eight of its members. Eight of them? Well, where are they now? Five of them you passed outside in the cave. I'll deliver the other three before morning. You know, Batman, this is a great moment for me. I always wanted to get a look at that face of yours. Emily, why didn't you watch him? Well, I'll go get him. Are you kidding? I think I'd better leave also, sir. The master will be worried about me. All right, go ahead, but let this be a lesson to you. The Batman never needs any help from the likes of you. You'll never know how right you are, sir. Captain Arnold. You don't mind if I go now, do you? Oh, I beg your pardon, Miss Page. I'll take you home myself right away. That won't be necessary, Captain Arnold. I'll do that. Bruce! Well, where did you come from? Well, Dick and I have been searching all night for Miss Page. I'm certainly glad we finally found her. You found her? Oh, she was found by my ace detective, the Batman. The Batman? Mm -hmm. Gee, I wish we'd gotten here in time to see him. Where'd he go? I sent him out to bring in three suspects, spies, that I just captured. Emily! Well, I guess there's no use of my trying to do anything. The Batman always gets there ahead of me. Oh.